In the production of my videos, I always try my very best to be fair and frank as possible. Now, this individual tends to share his story about the whole entire situation as it relates to Bodycat, Jizzy Burke, and the program. He goes by the name Lee, but most of you know him from the program as Grizzle Boss. He's going to share his side of the story right now. When you have that right now to share with you on the program, this is Links to Blow 7 TV. Let's talk, and we'll be right back after this break. Welcome back and thanks for joining us for the program. It's Links to Blow 7 TV. Let's talk. We ask you, please remember to like, share, subscribe to the channel so you're notified whenever we post new videos. Very important topic to discuss today on the program and it's related to the body care program and the follow between the members of that platform. Well, Lee took the time out to share his story and I'm going to be very fair about this. I've already shared Bodycat's story. I've already shared Sean's story. Now I'm sharing Lee and I'll be sharing Jizzy's side of the story as well. But in this video, this video is totally about the big man himself. He rose to fame from the Bodycat program. You might know him as Lee, but many of you call him the Grizzle Boss himself. So he was a contributor to the Bodycat program and he has been coming in a number of the videos and building a platform for himself. However, he has branched off right now and is doing his own thing and has started his own YouTube channel. Wow, but what really led to this and what transpired before this leading after the whole entire breakup between Bother Cat, Jizzy Burke, Sean and now Lee has parted ways with that team. He's going to share his side of his story right now, right here on Links of Blow 7 TV. But before we divulge the details of that right now, we just want to backtrack a few months ago and just analyze the situation and see what really went down. So as you know, Sean parted ways with the team some months ago and there was many rumors speculating as to what led to that. And Sean came out and shared his side of his story. If you want to see what Sean had to say, you can just check it out on my channel. Or you can just go over Sean's channel as well to check out the full and entire clip of that. But Jizzy now and the whole entire team have fallen apart. What led to this still puzzles many. After the two, and the, the team I should say, was doing so good. And that would be the two individual that started the whole entire movement of the channel that would be Drizzy and Body Cat. The channel was so successful that within a few months, the channel was able to garner over a hundred thousand subscribers and they received their plaque from YouTube, which was very good by the team. And it was just a full celebration that led to that. And fans were happy right across the world and people were looking forward for them to grow even bigger. And this now came as a shock to many, even myself as well, based on how I was a supporter of that channel. And I would normally watch all the videos that were posted over there from Bodycat and the team. I really enjoyed watching those videos and I believe that Bodycat is really a comedic character. And he was discovered by this individual and put out there to the world. But one thing I want to point out that Bodycat is an original individual. He's not a fake, right? And when you look at how Body Cat talks, that is how he is. It's not anything he's putting on or he's trying to express himself to seem more than he really is, right? He's that individual within himself and he just portrayed that outwards for others to see. What Jesse Burt did was to highlight the world about this individual and let him became um, aware of the surroundings and also let people became aware of this individual but what led to the fallout still is a mystery to many after the two had cemented themselves as a household name on screens right across the world now we are going to share lee's side of the story as lee seemed very upset as he appeared in a number of the videos and states that he was not getting any money at all from the management of that platform and i must say if you can look in within yourself and you see someone coming on your platform and they're giving a proper reasoning and the fans are liking it 
it will be good within yourself to just think about it and say all right then this individual is coming on my platform from time to time the most kind thing you could do is just give him a thing from now on again and let him feel good right instead everyone is stating that they did not receive any money and a number of individuals have appeared in the video and have shared similar sentiments are they lying well we're gonna hear Lee side of the story right now, right here on Links of Low 7 TV. So let me get that video queued up for you right now. And we're going to share Lee's side of the story and just listen to what Lee had to say about the whole entire situation that went down. And we're going to just give you our input afterwards. So let's go over to that video now from Lee. Yeah. So remember when you remember, you know, remember when me, 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 me can't want to meet right this way, you know, and me attack and say, yeah, you know, can't. You are the big man. See? You are the boss. You see any problem you have? All right. You call it me and we talk. I don't want nobody to you talk about this. I talk to Jizzy. With that. You, them come to you and you talk to Jizzy. Simple. I remember every man ever like people talk to them. You know. Who you fear talk to Jizzy? Eh? Who you fear talk to Jizzy? I don't want to. You are the big man. You are the big man. You are the big man. Remember that. I'm going to give you five Come to make one million dollars in about two. You make ten. Ten thousand. And you pop down. Because when you see ten thousand. Yeah. And a one million you come to make it. Yeah. If you can't share ten thousand, you have to share one million. Mm. Like to, just to get the money and buy this and buy that. Well, you see, I'm going to get the money and buy this. First thing you can't think about, woman first. You see the man who is making money and coming. You have to think about him too. The type of you have to think about him. And then you have the whole time to think about your woman. You have to make sure the money is alright. Oh, you get the next month. If the one then is alright, you get the next month. I don't know if you have the money after that. I don't give a five five bills of time and lose one. What hour? What hour? How we know? I don't know where I work for once. But Mara, boy, you're not here. But a man views and conscience there. I know, see, I'll give me a money. I hear you, I remember me as a fool, you know. So you see when fool get wise, where wise guy you do? I saw, I saw, yeah, that's it. You have to make sure you can't leave a man. You can't leave a man to give me your money. Mm. You must come and say, yo, yeah, give me your money. And you come, give me your money. Because you no must give me. Because I'm not a boss. Yeah. So, I'm not a boss. You can't tell no man to pay. All right. Give me your money then. Let me see. I'm not a boss. You can't take yeah. it from the money and give me your money. And you make man tell me, say, yo, you, you ain't give me beer, you ain't give me money every time. Eh? Every me day I get money, more than I beg on the beer. So, I'm not a beer, the man, them pay, you know? Alright. And yeah, but sometimes, been... sometimes you used to be blamed because I don't have this is paper minute, I don't come around here now. I don't, and then, 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 I know one day you know leave chop a water right now. No time. Remember me tell you that I'm a cup over cool now. So many. You might ask some people tell me, say Lee, what me can't believe that tell you that. I mean I say you know say I just talk him at all. Yeah, because some only for people are watching me and I say yo, they like me now, night thing. I mean they and I say, I mean I get no money now. I do everything to make everything all right. That's what I say, Richie. So I say, so I say, I'm just a liar. Man, I tell me, say, I take something with a woman's tech. Figure that she'll pick me. Eh? What kind of talk? So why do you want to say that? No, you want to make me look small at every time. I feel that way. 
Yeah. So when me when me when me get wise and I me just do my own thing, brother. Remember me tell you, I'm my own thing. Me a deal with. Lee, I me no want him to post Lee. So me say, you know, the man mad I run me down. Oh, him not seen a video with me. Me say, ah, this is. So me say, then now the people them a say, oh, them a see Lee and he not seen it. He must say, in can't find me, I'm a vicar, I'm a vicar. Don't you? Every time, I'm a phone, Every time, I'm a phone, I'm a phone. That is no excuse. Oh, you can't find Tolo for post, and you can't find me. Well, if you can't find me for post, I'm a post Tolo. I'm not telling you about Tolo. You understand me, so that he's a Tolo. He's a Tolo, he's a Tolo, he's a Tolo, he's a Tolo. You understand me kind of want somebody to get against me to you know. Yeah. You understand me kind of want to do nothing and nobody to say nothing to him. So I guess that's the problem brother. So me no business with who want big sound who want hate me. You understand me brother? Yeah, me at, nobody can man, take you away from me. And I don't talk like you individual no. only for friends him have and fans you know man. Yeah. You understand me? So who want hate and like? First thing, I don't know nothing about no shirt. I don't know nothing about nothing. Oh, that's how I feel. What else can I do with you? Let me have a talk. You know, I'm a fifth flyer. That's how I'm a skipper. Where me have a set up? Hey, Buster, see that? When them they lose the money, when they say cats and them thieves. Only is that ever thing, man. Um, um, them them already, yeah. Him say one about the money. Well, me have to lend JV your money, you know. Him pay back cats, you know. Me have to lend back JV your money for him pay cats, you So, what is the money there? Mm. Mm. Eh? Can you say never have the money, and me tell him, say, you have to see your money, pay back cats. And he take me about four days for him back the money. But you don't want eruption. I mm. don't like eruption. Yeah, 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 we just have to live good and do the right thing. You see me? No, just say, I can do something and give back money. Well, there you have it from the boss himself, Lee, aka Grizzle Boss, who rose to prominence on the Body Cat program and have started his own channel right now. But when you look at the situation and analyze what is going on, so much individuals could not be telling lie based on how they express themselves and the manner in which they portray the channel to be. Um, Lee states that he did not receive any money. From time to time, the most thing that he will get from the manager of that channel was a beer or so. I could hear one individual stating in the background that is beer you're paying the man with. No, it's a sad situation that went down. And when you look on how they spend so much time building this channel and how it does crumble, it's a very sad situation. But only if the management of that channel had put measures in place and just regulate the thing in such a way that is very transparent where everyone could see what was going on. But at the end of the day, he was the one that was in charge of the whole entire production and management of it. Bodycat did not have access to the channel, so Bodycat was not able to see the earning that was being made. So whatever he come to Cat and state that if $10 make, Cat would just have to accept it. And when the real truth came out about the situation, it just unfolded and became a big drama on social media as everyone came out and gave their own side of the opinion on what really transpired. But it's a, but it's a sad situation and I'm telling you, it could have been dealt with in a more professional manner by the team. However, what is done is done and everybody has branched off and doing their own thing which I believe is the best move right now because based on the tension that is in the crew, this would have been the most likely option for the many of them to take. And I must say that it's a sad situation and the, and the fans are very sad right across the world based on what transpired because I heard them talking, I've read the comments online and it's a situation that many did not forecast or see coming in the near future. But it has happened and the team has split and they're going to do their own thing. So let's just see what's to come from this. But as it relates to the fallout, trust me, it was a nasty one. And one in which this is an eye-opener to many individuals out there right now that really put persons in charge of your entity or your business or whatever you're doing. You have to have an input in it and know what's going on. Because when you don't know what is going on and when you find out what is going on, this is what it can lead to. 
drop it in the comment section how you felt about lee sharing his side of the story and just always remember like share subscribe to the channel so you're notified whenever we post new videos i'm out for now in my next video though i'll try to share just the side of the story and let you have a listen to what jizzy had to say about the whole entire situation that went down so look forward to that video to come next all right i'm out for now have a blessed day peace